Hello and welcome to a new game, The Vanishing of Ethan Carter. I'm Liara and today we are going to explore this uh, first person mystery game together. Uh, the, the store in Steam literally has no information other than it's a mystery game, um, but it looks pretty interesting from the clips that I saw. So without further ado, let's hop in and see who Ethan Carter is and how he vanished. All right. So this game is a narrative experience that does not hold your hand. Oh boy. Should be fun. Ethan Carter, I didn't know. But he knew who I was. When the police won't help you and the priests don't believe you, you call on Paul Prospero. You call on me. Okay. If you're a kid like Ethan, you're right. Plenty do. Ethan's letter started out just like any other fan mail. But soon there were mentions of things no little boy should know about. Uh -oh. There are places that exist that very few people can see. Ethan could have drawn a map. I hadn't entered Red Creek Valley yet, but already I could feel its darkness reaching out for me. Finding Ethan Carter wasn't going to be as easy as knocking on his door. I was too late for that. To <laughs> find Ethan, I had to figure out what this place was trying to hide from me. Oh boy. All right. So, what do we got? Um, okay. We're on a railroad track. It's not going to hold our hands, so I guess that means we're going to have to explore ourselves. I wonder how far we can go. Uh, hello? What is this? Sense trap okay what am I looking at interesting okay I'm not sure what I'm looking at here this is interesting okay can I look at it from different sides What about if I come at it from this side? What's going to show? The same thing? Okay. Well, I don't know what that's about. Is there something else up here? Let's see. Okay. What do we got? I don't know what this sense and trap stuff means. I guess I'm just kind of... I'm not sure. That's, uh, interesting. I'm not sure what I'm looking at there with that, though. Alright, well, let's keep going on and seeing what we can see. What is that, like, gum. <laughs> Let me go down this way. There's a cliff over there. We don't want to jump off the cliff. Alright, good. It won't let us. <laughs> that would not be good. So, let's see. Anything over this way? What's up here? Some rocks. Okay. There doesn't seem to be anything over this way immediately. It sure did seem mighty lively over there. Here's a path over here. Okay. We're back to the railroad. Okay. What's down here? Yeah, another little path down here. It's very pretty, though. Alright. Um. Oh, 
what? Can we look at anything over here? There's, I'm not, I'm really unsure what this uh, trap and sense mechanic is about, but we'll figure it out. After all, we're a mighty detective, right? <laughs> okay, another trap, I guess. I really don't know what that's supposed to be showing me unless it's the actual symbol. Like, each time I'm getting a little bit more of the piece. Of, of what I'm looking at. So maybe that's what this is. I gotta find clues and I'm going to get um, the full the full picture after I get everything because the first time I only had one little piece of that swirly then I had two and now I have three. So let me keep looking around and see if there's any more any more clues because that seems to be um, what I'm looking for. I can't go down that way. Okay. So we found that one, and one up there. Let's see if there's anything right over here. Any more traps, or surprise jump scares, anything like that. Anything over this way. We're around looking through the forest here. We may have to go down further down the, the tracks too. Like we may have... Um, gotten all the clues in this particular area, perhaps? Well, let's get back to the tracks, I think. Alright, so we can run with shift. Nice. Alright, so this is back where we were. Let's see. And we took that path before. Let's see what's over here. Bridge closed. Do not enter anything over here that we can look at. Bridge seems super safe. Red Creek Valley seemed like a quiet, ordinary place. I've learned two things in my life. No place is truly quiet, and nowhere is really ordinary. Mm -hmm. Ethan warned me about that. Warned me not to be fooled by what I saw here. He didn't need to worry. I'd worked dozens of cases, hundreds. This would be my last one. Already I knew that. I wonder why. Uh, are we gonna are we gonna die? Like, did we just have a premonition of our own death, or are we just gonna be so disturbed by what we find out that we're gonna retire permanently? I don't know. Well, hopefully we're going in the right direction because we didn't get all of the the clues filled out. Let's see, what is this? We got, okay. What is this? Inspect. Blood? Animal? Human? Accident murder? Crankshaft. Fresh scratches, recently used. Where's the crank? Okay. So we need to find the crank. Where would it be? So let's let's see if it's in here. What's in here? Board back. Turn off. Okay. Alright. Anything... Alright, we can exit it. Doesn't look like I see anything else immediately around here. Alright. Alright, um... What about back here? Do we got a crank back here? Hmm. I don't see anything. Did... Let's look out here behind 
back here on this path. Maybe we'll find some more information. Let's see. Okay. All the flowers. Alright. Anything over here? Um, that's... Okay, wait. That is a different... That is the same one we were just looking at, right? Did we just do a circle? Hey there! How's it going? I see you lurking. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I don't see anything immediately obvious. Let's keep checking it out. Can't go down there. Maybe we'll find another clue along the path somewhere. Anything up over here? Let's see. So many nooks and crannies on this path. Alright. What is this? Alright, let's check that out. We got cut ties. Um, it's tied, but no blood. This rope. Um, so was something tied here? I don't know. Alright. So there was rope on the tracks. Hmm. But since there's no blood, it wasn't like a, you know, a, a deadly do right situation. I don't think anyone was tied to the tracks. But maybe something was tied to the tracks. What's over here? Just rock. Um. Okay. Now this looks like blood. Yeah, this is a blood child. Let's... Victim dragged away, crawled away? I don't know. Uh, severed legs. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not good. Alright, let's follow the blood child. What do we got? Alright, um... Let's see, who is this? Blood from leg... Fractured skull? Cause of death. Maybe blood loss or head trauma? Not sure which. Let's see. What do we got? Um. Not sure. I don't know what I'm looking at here. Not yet. Death scene eroded by time, disturbed by a third party. Are we gonna get any more information? Is he some kind of like mythical, you know, like mystical sort of detective? Like, does he have magic powers? I wonder. Okay. So let's see. We have anything else along this trail? Maybe. What do we got? What's down here? Nope. We got an overlook here. Let's go down to the water's edge, I guess. Let's see what we got down here. Alright. What are we going to find? Will there be anything in the water, perhaps? Seems mighty peaceful here, except for, you know, the dead body up the way. What will we see? I don't see anything immediately in the water. Alright. 
let's see. Nothing, nothing apparent. Okay. So I don't think there's anything at the water. What is this? Some kind of crevice, okay. Let's go back up. And I think the other way is blocked by rocks. Let's see what we got over here. We got some more. Oh, we got a train car up here. Okay. Nothing over here by the rocks. What? Before I go there, more rocks. So much wide open space. Alright, let's see what's with the train car. Okay. Um, can we open any of them, maybe? Or climb up? No. What am I hearing? I'm hearing so much creaking sound. Alright. Can we do anything with these train cars? No, nothing yet. Okay. So, I don't know... Can I see in there? No, I can't get close enough to look in, it doesn't look like. I don't see anything. Anyways. Alright, what do we got up ahead? Let's see. Got a wood pile here. Nothing unusual about that. More train tracks over this way. The train tracks don't seem to get a whole lot of use. So I wonder if that car was used for the amputation of the legs. Like, we may have to go back that direction. But here's the train station. We'll get up on the platform and check it out and see what's up. Let's go around this way. Very pretty game. Even if it is a bit dark. Alright, anything of interest? It all seems perfectly normal. Nothing seems out of place. I mean, I don't know why this bench is way out here. So, The fact that it's sitting out there instead of over there and all this overgrown stuff really makes me think that these train tracks are not used. Like, at all. And if they're not used, then that begs the question, what is with all this train activity going on? Alright, what else do we got? We're just exploring around. Some open world exploration. We got a little structure over here. What is this? No trains have been through here for a long time. Exactly. That was part of a pattern. Large pieces of this country were thrown away, doomed to become, and then remain, the worst versions of themselves. Beneath all that rot, dark things grow. So it would seem. Alright. So, I don't know what to make of that structure. This is another abandoned uh, train, train carts. What do we got down there? Looks like um, a dam down there. Alright. What else? I guess the town... Is that... I guess we're coming up upon the town. Alright. Maybe we can get some more information about what's going on there. We might have to come out here and investigate some more, because it's just kind of... I don't know. There's a, a lot of 
unanswered questions out there just in our little walk to town. Alright. I see. Look how pretty that is. Autumn, because the leaves are falling off. Oh, I love that view. I've seen every version of people hurting each other. Hurting themselves. And we blame it on compulsion, selfishness, madness. I suppose the idea is, if you name a thing, you can control it. There are things in this world that cannot be named. I love the mountains. It's not home if it's not the mountains. Alright, so we're getting to the town. Maybe we'll be able to talk to people. Like, will there be people here? Or will it be like an abandoned uh, village? I don't know. Yeah, so we're gonna find out. A long walk. I guess you couldn't really take a car here. Not really set up for that. Too old and abandoned, perhaps. This doesn't really look like a driving bridge, necessarily. So what are we going to see here? Got very quiet all of a sudden. With our dirt roads. Alright, let's go up this way. Let's see. Alright, we're... Who... What are we going to find in this house? Anything at all? Let's look. Alright, our first house. Okay. Can we even go in? No, we cannot. What about this other door? This is probably more like the front door. Oh, uh, uh huh. Okay, so it's just completely abandoned. Okay. So, like, this town is just empty then, I imagine? Let's read. Okay. What do we got? Um, I invoke the boneless one, the one of voids, destroyer of ships, and he who is feared by the winds. Hear me. Great Minister Folkalar, I wish to make a pact with you to confound my enemies and protect my possessions. Use the doors of confusion to cloud their judgment. Seal the path with falsity and guile, and permit only those who can discern every true interior to pass. Aglon, Tetragram, Vashion, uh, stim Stimulate, Stimulamaton. Okay, this isn't English. This is like some kind of chanting. Okay, so or, or perhaps it's like in a foreign language because the end there, te adoro e te invoco, that sounds like foreign language. Not sure which one offhand, but alright. That definitely sounds like a cult. Uh, what? 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 Okay, interesting. So, what am I even looking at? Interesting. Let's see what we got. Okay, this is so weird. Let's see what we got here. Got a picture of a horse with a bunch of dogs. That is a weird mechanic. What am I aiming to do there? Like, whatever it is. I, like, got rid of the blue thing. Let's go up here and see what we got. Do I need to... Okay. Huh. So these are different places we can go, maybe? Okay. Got a spider web out there, it looks like. Okay. 
Now that was the room we went into before. Okay, so... What is this room? Okay... I'm not exactly sure what we're doing with that. I hope it's, we'll eventually be able to see all the stuff that we need to. It's interesting that that one was red. Let's see. Is this like a teleport? Okay. What are we seeing here? Let's go here. Okay, so this is where... Oh. Oh. Okay. So, okay. So we came back out. Interesting. Well, let's look around here and see what we got. Anything in this attic? Okay. We might have to read that note again to get back into that um, into that world. Okay, so let's go back down. I don't see anything here, but maybe we can find a clue from that other stuff. Okay. Alright, so now, yeah, now we're back there. What can we see? First, let's look upstairs before we go. Anything up here different? Okay, we got this. Um, what options do we have? Is there any options? No, there is not. Well, let's go in. Now we have options, right? So... What would this be? Okay. I think that one we've done. Let's see what this is. Oh, is this back to the other world? Oh, that's the note. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, but we... Okay. So, I wonder if there's a certain number of options you can do. Okay. So, we haven't done this one. What is here? Okay. And then over here is, like, the same thing, I think. I think those are both the same thing. We got these stairs. Oh, there's stairs down. Can we go here? I haven't seen stairs down. Okay, what do we got? All these weird portals. Where are they going to lead, I wonder? Alright, anything back this way? No, does not appear. Alright, what do we got? That... Um... Okay, so those are our three options there. What about here? Okay... Um... Well, I guess let's just do... The okay, so that was an incorrect one, I, I think. Alright. I think when you have red, it's like taking you out of the place. Perhaps. Of course, I don't know. So that was not a correct place? Perhaps? Um, hmm. Okay, well, we're still in it right now. What else are we going to see? There, there may be nothing else that we can do right now. Like, we may have to come back to this, perhaps? That's another upstairs. How big is this house? What's in there? Uh, is that the front door, maybe? I want to do this one. What is this? Got a chair here. 
an office. Okay. It's definitely some kind of abandoned office. What else do we got? Um, nothing really. Other than a bunch of weirdness. Alright. I don't even know where we are. Can we tell by looking out the windows, perhaps? I don't know. I feel like we're somewhere else. There's the spiderweb thing. Alright. Hmm. I guess we are here. I don't know. Huh. That's interesting. Alright. We can come back to this. Maybe we'll get some more information in, like, another house? Because, yeah, that house is not big enough for all those rooms, for sure. Not by a long shot. Okay, um... What is this? Can we get down there? Guess we'll have to go all the way down here and around. Let's see. Man, there is so much... So many unanswered questions. Like, every time I find something out, it just opens up, like, a thousand new questions. Alright. Like, it's not just the vanishing of Ethan Carter at this point. It's, like, the vanishing of all the people. So the, this obviously does not work. This elevator is out of commission. Alright. Um check out the next house. Um, that one's a pretty big house. And then let's see what let's see what's up in here. Wonder if we'll find more of that weird spell stuff. Alright. Let's look around the perimeter first, just in case. Old fashioned water pump. Okay, or I guess we could just go in here. Um, what are we seeing? Oh, were we telling? You can feel it, right? Something, uh, something coming from the Vandegrift house. I can feel it. Ethan disturbed the sleeper. He must be punished. Really? Okay, so we're picking up some latent psychic vibes of some What did kind? you do? What did you wake up? Nothing. I found a room. I walked into it. That's it. Huh. Well, I mean, that's what we did. It's very dark over there. Um... Okay, so we got another note or another thing. What do we got? On the on the day the photo was taken, Uncle Chad was mean, Dad was sad, Mom was mad, Travis was loud, Gramp was quiet. Yeah, they all look so cheerful. Hmm. I can't get back there, can I? Yeah, I can. Okay. What is over here? You need to talk to your son. He was poking around in the old Vandergriff house again. Said he found some secret room. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, really? Okay, I will go talk to him. Okay, let's go upstairs. Are we in his house? Is this Ethan Carter's house? Let's see what's over here. Um, Travis, leave the boy alone. I see how you've been looking at him. You don't even know, do you? You have no idea what's going on. Okay. 
Um, what's in here? This looks like a, a family, uh, like a have to help us. family room. It's the only way. It wants Ethan. You're crazy. You've all gone crazy. Are they gonna sacrifice him to some kind of demon? Is that what we're seeing here? Let's see. Whatever it is, it seems to have caused quite a lot of destruction. I feel like we we teleported here from that other house. These were the stairs down and up, right? Pop, they're getting worse. They keep talking about this thing, this sleeper. I know. What I don't know is if it's real or not. Something's real. Okay, so I just walked around. Let's go up again. All right. It could just be all these houses are built similarly, but I swear this stuff looks familiar. Did I just hear a footstep? place is eerie. Okay, what do we got up here? It's not my fault. I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Uh-oh. Yeah, we have definitely seen this. This is the family blamed him. Whatever it was he'd accidentally let loose, his family was convinced that hurting him would solve their problems would soothe their disturbed minds. Whatever That's a haunted messed the Carters up was still here somewhere. In the wind. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so we definitely teleported here. That other house, because we came here. I'm, I'm 100% sure. There is no way that they had the exact same chair with the exact same desk and all the books exactly that way all right did I explore everywhere in here I think I did um, pretty sure okay so this was his house obviously whatever it was was destroying the house okay what do we got over here? Alright, so this is just going around the house then. So they had the big house over there, and we were definitely teleporting to it from that one. Because this the doors I was seeing were very familiar. Alright, what do we got over here? This is just like, I don't know, a little powerhouse of some sort. Anything I can do over here it doesn't look like it. Okay. All right. Anything over here? Anything in the water? Just the sound of water? Alright. Let's just head along this way a little bit. Can I see anything down here? Nope. Alright. Let's just go along the water for a little bit. Alright. Um, got a tunnel up here. Okay. What's through the tunnel? I've stepped through too many portals been present in too many worlds simultaneously bits and pieces of me stay on the other side waiting whenever i return to bring parts of those worlds back Do okay you know what ghosts are they're sad evicted things memories without homes okay so maybe he is some kind of paranormal detective and maybe he's investigating, like, 
paranormal uh, death activity. Let's see. Um, I guess now we're going away from town. I don't know. Wonder how far it'll let me go. What's up here? There's something over here. Can we get up here? Yes, we can. Oh. Uh, no, we can't quite get up there. Alright. Um, what about over here? So we got another one of those electricity buildings. Little... I, I assume that's what they are. Looks like there's, like, power boxes in there. I've never seen a house built around one before, but... Maybe that protects it from the weather or something? Okay, so we got some kind of cave entrance here, perhaps? What's right here before we go down the other way? Okay, nothing. But what about this? Is, this looks like it could be something. Maybe. Some ornate gate work there. Can I get in there? It's locked, whatever it is. Okay, so maybe, maybe I need to find some kind of key or something, I don't know. We got anything up the mountain. All right, what's up here? What do we got? I'm not seeing anything up here so far. But, I don't know. This isn't a hand holding game. To say. You'd be surprised by how little they know. The dead can't explain what it means to be dead. They walk down stairs that disappear beneath their feet, headed for some bright blade of memory they'll never reach. Interesting. I wonder, are we dead? <laughs> like, is that why we can walk through these portals? I'm curious. Alright. It's like a... Um, like a logging... Um... Area? Where they were cutting down trees, perhaps? What do we got? I think that house is one we've already explored. What do we got over here? Anything at all? Mm, nothing we can get to. Alright. Um, let's keep on... Keep on trucking. See if there's anything through these trees. Um, what is this? I see like crevices, but I don't know. No caves or anything that I can tell, other than that gate, that ornate gate. Um. 
Are we walking away from town now? I don't know. I have no directional sense. I don't see anything in the landscape, though. Nothing that might be of use. So that was a very small town, if that's all there was to it. Let's get back to it and see what else there is. Alright. What do we got? This is the house that we went in, right? Is it? Well, we went... Yeah, this was Ethan's house. So is there anything... We went down that path before, right? And this is the one we just came down. Is there any other structures up here? Or are they kind of isolated? I don't know. Let's see what we got. Um, do we go this way? I guess let's just keep going down the path. Because I'm not sure where else we would be going. What do we got? Okay, so we got a path. Let's follow the path. Maybe we'll find some more stuff up here. Alright. Let's head on along this path. Will we see anything at the end of it? up this way. More path. Alright. I'm not sure, I I think, I don't know, this, either we're going in circles, or it repeats, maybe? Let's see. I'm not sure if we came this way. It seems familiar, but a lot of this stuff feels familiar, like we've been here before, which is why I was like, are we a ghost? Like, are we... I don't know. What do we got? Let's just keep following the path and see what we see. I don't know. It's like my theme word of this, of this game, apparently. I don't know. I don't know. It seems like maybe it's different. Alright. So we got a path down that way, and then more around this way. We're like way in the mountains now. And I don't know if we're going to find anything out here. What? What are we even looking for? Like I was hoping there would be more houses or civilization. Okay, this is the gate again. Like, we saw that. We, we just walked all the way around, again. Okay, so what is over here, then? Hmm. Well, maybe we go back to that other house? I don't know. Perhaps we'll get, um, conversations now that we've had Ethan Carter's conversations. 
Let's go see. Zoom. Okay, so we we're going around um, below where their houses are, I believe. Um, let's head around this way. But through the tunnel, this is, so we went through the tunnel and it was, it told more story. So maybe we weren't going in the wrong direction. I don't know. Let's go this way again. Let's head on this way. It's still a beautiful view though. Maybe there's more information along closer to like the edge. I don't know. Uh, is there any more city? Any more of the town, like, along this way, I wonder? Any stuff I can see in the grass? So, ghosts... Uh, we're learning about ghosts. And that they apparently... I, I really want to get into those tunnels. Like, I feel like there's something. Maybe I can get up to the right. Like, if I keep going right, I'm going into new areas, right? Um, but I think it's gonna dead end over here, so I cannot go any further in that direction. What about down here? Can we, this is where we came from, right? Okay. So we cannot go any further in that direction. What about this? That's just a crevice. Okay. Um... Anything else up this way? And that's a path that's going to lead for sure where I've come from. Let's just keep going up. Maybe up will lead us somewhere new. Because it's going very far up. I need some more story. Alright. Let's... I know we've been running around a good bit. I wonder... If, like, we need to find, like, a graveyard. Mm, perhaps. Alright, can, we can't go any further up this way, right? Now we're back to where they were cutting trees down. Can we go over this way, though? Cut through all of this and see what we got? Nope, okay. So, this is our boundary over here. Too many trees and rocks in our way to get any further in that direction. And if we end up getting right back to the house, that's fine. See, now we're up behind the houses. We're on the path behind them. I don't think I can go up this way, can I? Yeah, no. And that doesn't let me go any further. Alright. Well, back to the house as it is. Because, wait, this is a dip the same house, right? No. Wait. This is different. Is this a church? This looks like a church. And this is the graveyard. Well, I did say, are we looking for a graveyard? Okay. Got... It's, it's a Jesus statue. Alright. Must be a... Catholic graveyard, perhaps? I don't know. Of course, that kind of reminds me of, like, a Celtic cross. They're very pretty. What in the world? I see fire in the distance. Alright. 
All right, let's go into the church because this graveyard is humongous. Let's see if we get any any more story in here. Well, the church seems to be fairly well kept up with, although there's like no altar here. It's just darkness. Hmm. What do we have over here? Uh, okay. A lamp. Alright, let's uh, take it. Okay, um... Can we... We cannot go up any further. Alright. Um... What? We took it, but I wonder how we can use it. Like, is there a way to use our inventory? None of the normal buttons seem to want to work. <laughs> Alright. Wonder, let's see. Let me look at the controls. See if it says what the in, if there's an inventory setting. Uh, I do see one. Okay, so I guess I just I took it, but I have no way of using it. Okay. Did we explore fully? Let's see. I mean, we got the lantern. We cannot go upstairs. Right. Yeah, because I want to go upstairs. That ladder, or the stairs, are broken. Alright, and is there anything else on the pews or anything? I don't see anything. Alright, let's check out the graveyard. Surprised we didn't get any story there. Maybe there'll be a particular grave that will jump out at us. Of course, I don't know if I really want a grave to jump out at me, you know? Seems like very zombie-ish then. But let's see what we got. If there's any one in particular that... This is a lot of graves. Also, the graveyard is kind of overrun. Alright. Um... What about up here? What do we got over here? Like mausoleums, maybe? Oh, there's one that's open. Vandergriff. Uh-oh. This can't be good. Can I... Alright, let's pull. And let's inspect this. We got a handle. Crow. Yeah, there's a little crow. Um, I wonder what's going to happen if we keep doing that. Is it going to, like, consolidate? I don't know. Let's look at it. Is it going to... Okay, so I don't know. And I am unsure... It is very dark in here. Like, I cannot see anything. What does this do? Let's pull this again. Hmm. I feel like there ought to be something I can do with that, but I don't know. Um... I wish I could use this lantern. Oh, we can inspect this. Mortar, trowel, pile of bricks, uh, dropped work, interrupted, and wheelbarrow. Yeah. What can we do with the wheelbarrow? Can we do anything with it? Um, I'm not sure. Um, alright. Did they never seal it up, or did it get unsealed, I wonder? 
Uh, what is this? A brush, a bucket, and a crow carcass. Oh, they got crow. Blood is paint, ritual, crows killed, cut open with a knife, a dagger. So we have some kind of ritual here. Is that a crow? Alright, um... Can we go back and examine the, the crow down here? Will it make a connection? Hmm. Alright. So, no. But maybe we need some more clues. I wonder. Let me try doing the, the hold. See if holding down does anything. Uh. No. I don't see anything. But why? This is definitely some ritualistic stuff for sure. Alright, any other mausoleums open? Let's see. Oh, we got more stuff we can inspect. Burnt matches. An oil can. Maybe we can use that. Spilled oil, round stain, oil lamp. Okay, let's fix it. Alright. Uh, now, can we... Can we use the oil lamp somehow? want to use it. Let's see, what can we do with it? Can we... I want to be able to use it... in... the mausoleum. Am I missing stuff I need to fix it, perhaps? Alright, what do we got over here? Anything on this side of the church? Let's see. Um, we got just, we're, now we're back to the graves again. Not really seeing anything. Yeah, and it's super dark over here. Cannot see at all. I love how you can see the statue right from the door. Um, alright. Well, let's go back down, down there, I think. And see what we can do. Because we got all these... All these things, but what can we do to interact with them? Um... Can we do anything with the bricks? Doesn't seem. Is there. Oh! We can inspect this. Okay. Uh, the Henian Star, Gina Corvi, Wing of the Crow, Crow's Foot, Nero Cross, Witch's Foot, Broken Cross, Sacrifice to Klepot? Alright, so it's a sigil. Okay. Um, anything on this side? Okay. Are we going to get any more information? No, but that definitely... Can we put it on the sigil? I wonder, I wonder. Like, it's all far apart here. But then we line it up. Aha! Ah, now I'm understanding. Okay, okay, okay. What do we see here? Oh, okay, so we're seeing the crypt. Uh, what else? It's very, very dark. Can barely see anything. Okay, so it's spinning around the, the crypt then. Okay, what about the crow? Can we do the same thing with the crow? Alright, let's see. I kind of want to go back to the handle now and see if we can do that. Let's 
a bit of a run, but... Alright. Let's see what we can see here. Okay, yeah. So this is exactly what I thought. Like, the crows were used for part of the ritual, right? Maybe this is a particular crow? by the statue. Okay, let's go see if we see it there. Uh, let's head on over this way. Alright, it was near the statue beside like right around here, right? Or maybe right around here? I feel like it was around one of these ones. Maybe this one? Aha! Okay. So now, can we um, use that on... Oh, what do we got here? Signs of struggle. Several different footprints. Blood, human, crow. Alright, so we got a blood stain. Okay. All right. Um, perhaps a crow? I don't know. Let's see, can we do anything with... We really need... This is just going to show us in the mausoleum. I think that's showing us the crow figure, which we now we can now fix it. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Now can we pull the lever? Uh, oh. Nice. So now I can see stuff. What do we have here? Uh, oh. My. It's a crow dagger? Okay. Cause of death. Chest wound. Oh, no blood. Postmortem. Facial cut. Shallow. Minimal bleeding. Blood streaks. Back wound. Single attacker. Multiple attackers. Okay. So if there's no blood, um, then how did he die? Okay. So what are we looking at? This mechanic I haven't quite figured out yet. Let's see. Can we? not sure what we're looking at here. I guess we can only see um, certain areas. Maybe we can look around him and see anything over here. Uh, I am really not seeing anything. What about from this direction? Can we see anything from this direction? Anyone? I don't see anyone. What about from this direction? Um, what's over here? Um... Okay, I thought maybe there was a person there, but I don't see a person. What about this way? Do I see anything here? I see darkness. Anything from this direction? Oh, I can't reach him. Here lies my beloved wife, Emmet Spandergriff. Uh, and then some Latin, it looks like. I cannot see that far. But, now that we've got that lit, maybe we can... Oh, okay, we can fix the dagger. Okay. So we have fixed the dagger. There is nothing to look at there now. Okay. Alright, the oil lamp. Can I do anything with this yet? I really want to. Um, okay, so now what? I wonder. Wait. 
Oh, it's over here. So, we got the sigil. Is there anything else on this that we can inspect or examine? I want to figure out what to do with that body. That's confusing. Alright. Because if I do it this way, it's just total darkness in it. Uh, oh. Okay. Okay. What am I... I have apparently done something. I've done a thing. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's go here. What are we doing? We are looking at stuff. Okay. Um, did we have anything in here that we're looking at? No. Okay. Um, okay. What's down here? Yeah, we are definitely some kind of paranormal detective for sure. That looks like the mom. Is that the dad, perhaps? It looks like they're looking for... something. Are they searching? Is there more stuff up here? I'm hearing, like, wolves? Owls? Well, let's head in the direction they're looking at. What can we see? Are we going to find anything in this direction, I wonder? Is there going to be another memory over here? Um... What am I even looking at? I'm not even sure. Okay. Well, they're obviously looking for stuff. Is there anything over here that they were looking for? Anything on the path? Is there going to be anything revealed on the church? Let's see. Anything inside the church now? Nope, it's still dark as anything. Okay, so what do I do with this information? So... These guys look like they're just looking at each other. But over here, they're like looking for something, right? What are you looking for? I mean, you're obviously looking over here, right? You're looking over here. Is there anything that I can see over here? What? do I need to be looking for? Anything up there? Am I missing a memory? Did I not get all of them, I wonder? Maybe it is in the crypt, because they're like going into the crypt. But I don't see anything. Um, the brick? Um, what are you looking for? You're looking at him. Are you the guy that's dead? Are you? Is he the guy that's dead? I think that might be the guy that is dead. Did they kill him? Did they use the brick? Okay. Okay, I think I'm missing a memory. I, I think I'm witnessing, like, perhaps what they did to kill him. Because, see, she has that oil lamp, which was over here when we fixed it, right? And now it's just the two of them. I mean, it was the two of them over here. 
Okay, so do we have a memory on a little bit further? That I haven't seen, perhaps? Where? Maybe? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. So, let's go back and do that again. Because if we're able to, maybe we saw everything we were supposed to see. And we were wandering outside of the range of it. That's... Now we know what we could do to go back to the other dude and examine his stuff. Maybe that was practice? Alright. So. Um. Really need to figure out what we're looking at here. All right, obviously, is there anything over here? Did we miss an image over here, perhaps? I feel like we did miss an image somewhere, maybe. I don't know. It, it's like, it's telling a story, but what exactly, I'm not sure. Well, let's go look over here. I mean, if we're not wandering out of it, perhaps there's something we're meant to see over here. Um, where was that room? I don't even see it now. It was, oh, it was over here. Okay, so is there a memory over here now? Can I go up now? No. What is that sound? What even am I listening to? Alright. What am I missing? Is there something over here? I may have to, like, do the touch again if I go too far out of range. But I feel there's something around this church that I haven't found. Um... What are you two telling me? I'm not sure. You're looking over there. What is over here? Nothing, right? Nothing I can get to. Okay, so... What? not spooky sounds or anything. Is there any more memories, like over here perhaps? Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. I knew there was one more. Chronology. Okay. Uh, ah, okay. Um, I wonder if we have to tag them in order. Okay, so then... What would be first? Let me look at this one again. Alright, so this one, she is... He's attacking that guy. Okay, and she stabs him. So I think first, it's going to be this one, perhaps? Um, maybe one, maybe this one is two. All right, and then the next one, I think this one, regardless, has to be three. Uh, yeah, that one has to be three. Those may be swapped, I'm not sure. And then these ones, I think this one has to be four, because she still has her lamp here. And then I think this one is five. Let's visualize this. Chad, let me see it. Get the hell away from me. Okay, so we didn't have it quite right. 
Uh, I think these two are swapped. So let's let's see. This one is next, and that. Okay, now let's see. You know he's harmless. You know this is wrong, Chad. Okay. Um. Okay, are we wrong? Is this one one? Uh, previous? Okay, is that really one? Let's see. Dad, get off of him! He's your brother! Get... Okay... Let's see what this would be. Maybe I'm totally wrong. Let's try. What does this one say? Our boy. Chad is putting our boy in that crypt and breaking him up, giving him to the sleeper forever. Okay. Okay, so that one is not two. What is what is this one? Is this one possibly two? Uh, I just... Let's see. What would this be? Our boy. Chad is putting our boy... Let's skip the to the next on. scene. Okay. Okay, okay. So that one is not two. This is definitely one. Um... Uh, is this one too? You know he's harmless, and then this is three. Uh, and then this one would be four, right? And then the other one, five? Maybe? Let's see. Our boy. Chad is putting our boy in that crypt. And breaking him up. Giving him to the sleeper forever. Okay, what do we got here? He's harmless. You know this is wrong. Chad, finish those bricks before he wakes up. Uh oh. Ah, I see, I see. Chad, let me see it. Get the hell away from me. He should have been helping. Dale's weak. He always has been. You're right. This is a dysfunctional he family. Is weak. Dad, get off of him! He's your brother! Get off of him! Uh huh. Okay. Oh, he's gonna run away. The hell's going on? Where's Ethan? The one who sleeps must not sleep. Your uncle Chad is dead. Uh oh. Ethan. Okay. That was interesting. Very interesting. Man, they weren't kidding when they said they don't hold your hand on this. Okay, so we figured out... It's not right. Ethan's our boy. Dad, I need to get into the mine. What? Mine? My, my key. I, I don't have it. That's the gate, I, I I'll use the tunnel near the gate. Just, just keep Mom away from me, alright? She's sick. You're all sick. Huh. All right. The sleeper okay. must not sleep. Ethan disturbed something. Mm -hmm. Whatever it was, it got out into the air and into the minds of his family. Right. So now I imagine all of this stuff is non-interactable because now we have learned all the story of it. 
All right. That is super fascinating. All right. I really, really, really want to go back to the train tracks. And now that I know these mechanics, I know it's like kind of backtracking a bit. But now that I know what's going on, I want to go see what was up with that other body. So let's see if I can get down, if it'll let me. Hope I don't have to run all the way around. Can I go down this way? All right, and then after we do that, we can try and head to the mines. Let's just go quickly. All right, so we are definitely some kind of paranormal investigator of sorts. Learning a lot about what's going on in this town. That is definitely a messed up family. So I wonder what the sleeper is. Is the sleeper going to be like in the mines perhaps? I don't know. I'm glad that we can run though. Because this would be really annoying otherwise. So the only stuff that we found was the uh, train tracks. Uh, we were trying to find that crank. So now we know how those mechanics work. Maybe we can figure out what is the deal with that dead body that had the legs amputated. So let's run back across the bridge. I know it's a bit of backtracking, but I'm very curious. And plus we can enjoy the beautiful scenic uh, mountain view again. <laughs> so I wonder what the sleeper will be. Is it, It's got to be that... Um, like that demon that they were talking about in that one house. Who summoned it? Was it Ethan or was it someone else? Maybe he just was in the wrong place at the wrong time, perhaps? Oh. Mystery upon mystery. This is a very interesting game, though. Okay, let's get back to the train tracks. We should be pretty close to there. We're at the dam again. And now we don't have to, like, uh, waylay between the all the trees and stuff we can just go straight there and figure out what's going on all right that's the the one bad thing about um not getting any hints is we had no idea what to do with that one like i didn't know if that was just a mechanic we'd have to come back to um but then we, we went so far away from it i was like Okay, I don't know, maybe I wasn't sure where the story centered around, like where the the hub of the mystery would be, so to speak. And let's go see, we got the, the crank we can look for, and then we have the body that had the amputated legs that we can do a touch on and figure out. But first, we got to get that crank. We're almost there. We should be... That's an interesting rock. Alright, there's a rock slide. Uh, wait. It wasn't here, right? Was it up through here? Now I'm getting lost. <laughs> Let's see. Is it over here? Heading back. Okay. Had to get around that rock or whatever it was. Oh. Let's inspect dry grass. Severed leg. Oh, okay. Rectangle shape. Rail car from the bridge. Alright. So, now that we know how that works, yeah, we gotta get to the rail car. Yep. Okay, so inspect this. Gasoline, diesel fuel dropped in a rush. Alright, we got the canister. Nice. And then we already had the severed legs and the rope and the blood trail. And then the body's down that way. Okay, and so this should be up this way and we'll be able to find the handle. So it's a little bit out of order, but that's okay. Alright, so crank. 
Let's see, where's the crank? Alright, it's on the ground over there by the water near the rocks. Right? Okay. Let's go get it. Down here? No, not down here. It's gonna be near the body, I think. We'll head down there. We'll do the touch in a minute. When I get the, um, the crank first. Should be down by the water's edge. Which, why we didn't see it before, I don't know. Maybe we're just not quite in the right place. Alright, now we got it. All right. Now we can go fix that. Let's head on up. Back up we go. And we'll put that on um, the rail car, and then we can come do the touch on the body and see if we can reenact this death scene. I'm curious what sort of demented person cooked up this murder. Is this like fallout from what Ethan stirred up from the sleeper? Let's see. Alright. Let's fix it. Spin it. Alright. Keep spinning. Alright. Oh. Okay. Is it going to... Oh, okay. Interesting. So we didn't have to run the whole way. Very nice. So we could... Alright, now let's stop. Let, let's uh, get out here. That's nice. We didn't have to run the whole way. Well, the more you know. Now let's go down here. I guess we could have rode a little bit further, but that's okay. Uh, let's go down here and do the touch on the body. Um, let's see. Nope. I wonder if you just have to do it from different angles. Or if you have to get a specific angle. I'm not sure. Let's see. trying I think maybe we're almost there all right what are we gonna see I feel like there's a mechanic here I haven't quite grasped and I'm not sure if it's angle so I'm gonna just keep going around his body and trying Alright. Maybe I have to, like, get right there. Because it's pulsing, but what does pulsing mean? Maybe I have to do the legs? I don't even know what I did before. It was like the head. Right? Maybe? Maybe? There's his severed legs. Alright. Come on! Do the thing! Because I'm not sure which angle I need or where exactly I need to do the touch. Maybe on the arm. Maybe directly on the legs. Um maybe on the heart. I don't know. Um, we'll just try and get as far back as we can. Um, trying to see. 
see if there was anything else that I did. I don't think so. I think I just got lucky. We got his legs that time. No luck. Can we get the whole scene in? Let's see. Maybe we have to try and get like as much of the scene in as possible. Not sure. We got almost his whole body in that one. Maybe we have to look at it from this way. No. Nope. Maybe we have to look at it from where he was murdered from? I feel like it's very close. Alright, come on. Come on, my guy. Cooperate with me a bit. Where do we have to click? Or is there something we need to do to expand the bubble? Pushing buttons to see. Not seeing anything that we can do. Okay. So I feel maybe maybe it is just the right angle, but what would that angle be? Because before, with the other guy, we were looking at, like, his head? I don't know. Maybe we just haven't let it pulse enough or something. But it doesn't seem to be expanding. Alright. What about... What are we looking for exactly on the touch? This doesn't seem to want to cooperate at all. Okay, my guy. You need to uh, send your little ghost fragments out for real. Where do you aim for? I need to pay attention because I feel like this mechanic is going to come into play again and I should really know. Alright. Come on, mister. Tell us your story. What are we going to see? Is it going to be this way? Nope. Alright. I guess let's just rotate slightly around the body and see if any of it does it. That seems really finicky if that's it, though. I'm about to look it up, though. Um. Okay. Alright, let us look it up real fast. Okay. So, the vanishing of... Oops, if I could spell, that would be amazing. Um, how to do the touch. Um, so, let's see. Um... All right. Um, this is talking about the traps. Um, there's two to three things that need to be placed back at the position they were at before the murder. If you find uh, the place the object has to be placed, it will show you which direction. All right. Um, things that have to be moved in the first puzzle. A rock. 
Okay, so, okay, so maybe we can't touch because we haven't placed everything yet. Okay, well, that makes sense. So what else do we have to place, then? I did see a rock. Uh, where did I see the rock? Was it up here? I mean, was it a little higher up? Let's go ahead and get back in our rail cart and go backwards. All right. Maybe we have to move the rail coat cart back to where we, uh, where it would have happened, possibly. I don't know. I don't know, I think it's just gonna keep on going. Alright. Um We got the canister. Is there where is a rock? I don't even know what we did in place. Yeah, we got the rope. We saw the severed legs. We got the canister. What else are we missing? Because it's not opening it. So we have something else that we're missing. Um, was there a rock farther up, perhaps? Like, maybe we missed something up here? Let's see. Did we? I don't know. I don't see anything. Let's just take a peek around. See if there's anything else we can inspect. Because that apparently would be what we're missing. Aha! Okay. So, now we have found the rock, and it has blood on it. Alright, is it gonna, where is it gonna go? Where is the rope? The rope is up here, perhaps? Okay. Where do we place the rock? Um, does it go down to the body? Do we just touch the body now? I feel like we gotta place it somewhere. Yeah, we gotta place this rock somewhere. Where do we place it? Um... Cause I haven't really seen anywhere where we would put a rock. But let's run up here, just to see. Um... Cause apparently he got hit on the head. I think this is a little too far back. Okay, so where did he get hit on the head at? The rock was over here, so... Is it gonna be up here somewhere? Maybe? Perhaps over here? Where would we place it? Um, is it farther down the tracks? Aha! What do we got here? Ah, okay, okay, okay. Rock, divot, fresh dirt. I think I saw that, didn't I? Well, now we got the rock. Okay, so now can we solve this murder? Uh, where's the body? It's up over here. This one. Do we have enough now? Okay. Okay. Um, no? Do we still not have enough? Does, does direction actually matter? Hmm. 
Let's see. We got more of the picture now. What are we still missing? Um, not sure. Do we have to do the legs? Or are we actually, in fact, still missing something? Okay, so what would we still be missing? Um, maybe we have to move the rail cart. Maybe, may, I hope I didn't mess it up by, by moving this. Okay, let's see. Do I need to move it forward before the severed legs? Before the rope? Let's see. Alright. Let's see. Alright. We got the rope. Got the severed legs. Real. Uh, Alright. Let's see. How about now? My guy, what more do you need? What all are you lacking? I am very confused. Are we are we even actually still missing something? That's the thing I'm not sure about. What else would we be missing? Well, let's go look over here where we put the rock. Okay, so we got the rock here. Was there anything else that we were missing? Maybe we have to run the rail cart all the way down. Okay. Rail car. Oh, rail car is supposed to be right here. Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. I got it. Okay, okay. So, we need to run the rail car. Oh, I got it, I got it, I got it. Man. Let's put the rail car right where it says. Okay. Alright. So back we go to where it says rail car. And then hopefully that will be enough. Let's see. Almost there. A little bit more. Uh, I think this is okay. Maybe? Is that where it's supposed to be? Alright. Let's see if that's sufficient. Is it? Have we done it yet? Almost. Maybe we gotta run it all the way to the end. Alright, let's run it all the way to the end. All the way back. There we go. And then it should stop, right? We can't go any further back. If that's not it, then we may just have to... I don't know, position it just right? That's going to be a little annoying. Well, let's see. Still not enough, my guy? Okay. So, I guess we'll put... Maybe we gotta put it where the rail car goes and turn it off. Like, that could be it. Alright. Let's move it forward. Until... Until we're at the rail car. I guess it's going to be beside the canister, canister, right? Really close to the canister.
Let's see. Is this the right area? Okay. So, I think that's right. Let's see. Can we turn it off now? Alright. Now, is that enough? Maybe we had to turn it off before. Let's see. Still not enough? What... What more do you want? Spin crank? Okay. I guess you do want it on. I don't see rail car anymore. Is there something else on the rail car we need to do? I'm not sure. Do we gotta go to the severed legs? I'm not sure. Okay. I mean, I still don't see rail car. But this probably isn't going to be enough, is it? Okay. Where do you put the uh Where do you put the rail car? Um Let's see. Okay. So where... Alright, so we gotta drive it till it's over the patch of dry grass, but I thought I did, right? Did I not? Let's see. Let's go back a little. And check it out. Maybe, maybe I did not. I thought I did, but... Uh, well, I mean, the rail car isn't here now. So, that's something. Okay. I feel it's kind of silly I have to position this thing so exactly. Is the patch of dry grass back here? No? Okay, so maybe, maybe in fact it's over it? We got the rock. Um, I, I, I'm gonna see if this is enough? I don't know. Let's see. Still not. <sighs> Alright. What am I missing? What am I missing? Um. So we found the rail car. We've got it fixed. We found the rope. We found the severed bloody legs. We got the corpse. Um. We got um, the bloody rock, and we got the canister. Um, okay, um, and we've did we drive it over? Did we drive it over the correct area? Like, is there some other place where we can drive it over? Let's see. Let's look over and make sure we haven't missed something. We got the rope. There was nothing else up that way. Got the canister. Let me drive it all the way back and see what I'm missing. See if rail car shows up again. If not, um, I may have to... Okay, so rail car does show up again. 
so let me just let me pull up right next to the to the um the canister okay now it feel i feel like it's done something because i heard the sound will this be enough please 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 finally oh my gosh that was super annoying and not intuitive at all. Okay. I mean, because, like, I kind of figured out a good bit of what happened already. So there's one, two, three, four, five. We got to find all five of the things. Okay. So we got this. And this one. Okay. And up here we got one. Uh, excuse me? Are you kidding me? You guys are some messed up people. So I'm glad we came back to this. I thought this was just a side murder, but apparently it's part of the main story. Uh, and is there, there's one more. Alright, down here. Okay, so now are we ready to make... Nope, do we have more that we're missing? we can't do chronological order yet. So that was one, two... Oh, do we have to go down to the body area, maybe? Ah, yes. Now we can do chronological. Okay. So that one obviously is not first. Nor is that one. Like, this one? I feel... I want to know why he's here. Um, I almost think this one is four. Let's see. And this one, five? Let's see. Uh, uh, what are you guys saying? Is this one one? And then, um, wait, one, and then y'all, are you untying him? Maybe? Okay. Let's see, uh, did I, okay, I think this is out of order. Uh, three? Okay. Well, I don't know if this is right, but let's see. What am, am I missing one? Oh, I'm missing one. There's one down here. Right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. So this one uh, hit with the rock. So is this one going to be two, perhaps? Um, okay, he's got the rock here, so, okay, I think maybe you're one. You're feeling guilty about what you gotta do, but you're still going to go through with it, um, this dude gets a rock because he's not going to let you kill Ethan, maybe? And then he meets you, hits you over the head, and then you're staring at him, and then Ethan. Okay, I don't know. Let's see. Okay, so that's not the first one. Alright, uh, are you the first? Wait. Wait, are you the first one? Let's see. Listen to me. We can destroy it. I know how. You can't destroy it, Ethan. You can't destroy time. And 
that's what he is. He is forever. All right. So something happens next. What happens next? Um, is that the rock? It's gotta be, right? This one has to be second then. So this one has to be second. Uh, and then third, fourth? Maybe this one's third. Let's see. Let's skip to the next scene. Okay. So you I wish there was another way. Yeah, this family is definitely messed up. Travis, tell me where Ethan is. Now. I'm giving the sleeper what he wants. What all of us want. Look, old man, you need to go home. <coughs> okay. Well, you know. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. So now you're going to get what you were planning to do. Well, then, and so you crawled over here. Oh, okay. So we have these backwards. So this was the previous one. All right. So now let's watch the whole scene. Listen to me. We can destroy it. I know how. You can't destroy it, Ethan. You can't destroy time. And that's what he is. He is forever. Hail. Get the rock. Honey, I wish there was another way. Of course, I don't know why he's going after Travis, this guy tell me unless where Ethan is now. I'm Unless he's on what Ethan's he wants, side. What all of us want. Look, old man, you need to go home. <gasps> then Ethan gets out. And then he gets his just dessert. No. All right. Now what? Run, God damn it! Go! Get out of here! Yep, gotta get out of there. Travis, close your eyes. So be over soon. Okay. So, brutal murder. I wonder how that guy was related to Ethan. Was he like the brother or something? I don't know. But whatever it is, those people in this town have gone insane. For real. Alright. So now, that's heading over here. Let's see. Uh, okay, let's see what we got over here. Where is this leading us? We got one more, one more, uh, memory. Interesting. Grandpa? Stay away! Ethan, I'm sick too. I can feel the sleeper in my head. Uh -oh. Then fight it! I have to destroy the room! Corvus, I'm sorry. Ethan. Oh no! I can't let you do that. Oh no. Run, Ethan! Okay. Well. Whatever had turned Ethan's family against him. The grandfather was trying to resist. He was. Age helps against those things that feed on hate. Not because of wisdom or experience. Because the old are tired. Their hate is less useful. Okay. Yeah. So... I am glad that we went back and did that puzzle. Because that was a lot of story that... Uh, we had missed out on and yeah and so now I think I think the next step is going to be the mine I'm going to run back there real quick I'm not going to go in it today because we're at the end of the time 
but I want to get back there and at least see if that is where we were supposed to go next. So I'm just going to quickly sprint back over there. I know it's in this vicinity somewhere. I'm still curious about that house with all the the crazy doors and stuff. Maybe that'll make more sense in a little while. I don't know. But it felt like we were uh, jumping around. And maybe that's the room he's talking about destroying. Yeah, it could be. Let's run, a run back across the bridge to the house. Um, so we have that one. And, and there may be a, another scene too. Actually, I think... I think I might run back to the very beginning later uh, and see if there was anything to those traps because I don't think they were just there for giggles. I think perhaps we missed another scene because when I did look up information about the train scene, it was calling it scene two. So um, I, I think that might be where we'll start next time is seeing if there is something with that scene um, because obviously that must be more story so <laughs> this is definitely not a hand holding game but it's very interesting so far so we've seen two of the murders so far and what's going on with that so next time we will either check out the traps if there's anything to that or we'll uh, check out the mine or perhaps both so I hope you will join me next time and until next time Bye, guys.